You're tuned in to the Profit and Growth Hour here on WDRB Media and WGIV, the soul of Charlotte. I am Dr. Business, and I'm here on location at All Things Possible Ministries. Not some things, not a little things, not a few things, but all things are certainly possible. I have the uh, organizers, the CEOs, the executive directors here on the red carpet with me. We are at the Exalt Showcase, and I had an absolutely phenomenal time. Did you guys have one as well? A oh. phenomenal time? Absolutely. Because I saw you running around well. doing stuff, because obviously as organizers, there's 57 different moving parts that you have to there attend to. There's always something that's going to go sideways, mm -hmm. yeah. but it's part of the fun. Wow. Yeah, and it's really cool to see people enjoying it, mm -hmm. and feeding off each other, the fellowship that happens. Absolutely. Yeah. The connections, the networking, mm -hmm. uh, the ministry, the raising of the hands, and the mm -hmm. clapping, and yeah. people having an absolute phenomenal time. Mm -hmm. yeah. It was great. Why did you guys, now, it, the showcase has been around how many years now? This is the uh, fifth one that we've done. The fifth one. Mm -hmm. Wow. Why do you do a showcase like this? Why don't you go ahead? We, it, a couple of reasons. One, primarily to raise money for the operations of the ministry so that when we do medical fundraisers, 100% mm -hmm. of those funds can go to the recipients. Wow. But another reason is there's so much talent in this community, mm -hmm. in this region. Yes. Mm -hmm. To provide them a platform like this mm -hmm. is just beautiful. And, and this is more about connecting folks, mm -hmm. giving them an opportunity to share the gifts that they've been um, extended. That, we, we want to do that. So a lot of what we do is connect them with people in the industry, provide recording opportunities. Mm -hmm. um, we do a lot of other events throughout the year that we bring them along and add a music element to it. You certainly have some powerful heavy hitters here on uh, this evening. You had individuals that are part of the recording industry. You had Lejeune uh, Thompson here mm -hmm. on uh, this evening. And her you husband, had, Cedric, mm -hmm. yeah. Grammy winner. Absolutely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, Bishop uh, Carl Whedon, mm -hmm. he was here. Uh, so you just had a power mm -hmm. house filled of God's movers and shakers. Yeah, and God's just man. been blessing us. Wow. Yeah. Why All Things Possible Ministries? Why for you? Why for me? Mm -hmm. um, because what, well, what we do is bring the community together to help those folks that are in medical crisis to pay their medical bills. Um, and we were in that situation. Mm -hmm. I was very ill about um, 2010 and had a rare liver disease and my liver went sideways and I was in the hospital for a month and they didn't think I was gonna make it. Um, wow. And uh, it was just one of those strange things. Um, but you know, a lot of people and a lot of prayer Mm -hmm. And and I still have that same liver today. Wow. And thank you, God Jesus. Absolutely. Yes, and yes. Um, and because of, of us going through that situation where, you know, we had out of pocket bills that were, you know, over and above. You know, the insurance Say it paid. So. Yeah, the insurance <laughs> paid. Amazing how they add up. Yeah, but you know, you still have to pay twenty percent of whatever, mm -hmm. you know, whatever your plan is. But um, that's a lot of money when you're in the hospital for almost a month. That's you right. know. So um, I had heard Michael in the other room, um, when I was at, on the couch, you know, with cords and, you know, tubes coming out of me Drains and all this and kind all of stuff. Yeah. <laughs> I heard him putting our, the medical bills on credit cards. Wow. And I knew then that, you know, savings was gone and this was not good because he wouldn't have done it if there was anything else to do, you know? Absolutely. Um, and I thought, oh gosh, you know, and, and of course he didn't want to tell me about it because he didn't want to worry me. Right. Um, but He's we, a good man. I heard, I heard <laughs> and, it And anyway. we had 15 people wanting to bring me low. Oh yeah. yeah. And that's wow. all that goes so far. You know, yeah. 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 I mean, it's nice, you know, people bring food, but mm -hmm. when you're sick, you're not hungry. That is <laughs> so true. You're that not. Is true. So you end up with a bunch of stuff in your freezer. Whereas, you know, something tangible, you know, right. instead of making that casserole, you know, send 20 bucks to help with the medical bills. That is true. Um, yeah, we you know, we find that people real. want to help, they just don't know how. So that's a very good point. So that's it's true. just really providing an opportunity for them to be the hands and feet of Jesus. Mm -hmm. That's right. Yeah. Because that's really what we've been called to do. That's exactly. right. Uh, here on the mm -hmm. earth, obviously, man is no longer coming down from heaven. Mm -hmm. uh, so those hospital bills don't get paid for uh, by the hand of God. Right. But right. yet through people that mm -hmm. he sends our way, mm -hmm. are we able to be a blessing to others? Yeah, we had a, a recipient this past year, Jeff McGill, who died in the midst of the medical fundraiser mm -hmm. from cancer. Mm -hmm and wow. the medical bills don't go away. You know, yeah. that's part of the story. The family still carries that burden. So yeah. to be able to raise the money and take mm -hmm. that burden off the family. 
-hmm. we certainly have a heart and a passion for what it is that you do. Um, we were at ADC Cure for the Soul. Uh, we had five uh, bands perform there, mm, and nice. it was a cancer fundraiser. Nice. Uh, that was just a few weeks ago. Uh, mm -hmm. Last weekend, we were at Bike Night, uh, which was a fundraiser for uh, breast cancer. Mm. Nice. Uh, so we were there covering that event. Mm -hmm. We think that the media's responsibility mm -hmm. is to come out, be a part, and to showcase the wonderful things mm -hmm. that are being done for other people. Because yeah. so often, we get a black eye uh, mm -hmm. as media individuals mm -hmm. with regards to all the bad things that are going on and if somebody's shooting somebody or somebody throwing a rock somewhere we're yeah. there mm -hmm. front and center right but when we're being a blessing mm -hmm. where's the media well you know what the media has been a huge part of the success of this ministry because yes. mm -hmm. we've had just god blow the doors off using the media mm -hmm. classic example tanner who was here tonight we got the vehicle for mm -hmm. a woman saw a news piece she lives in Salisbury. It was sitting in her garage. Her mom passed away three years ago, and she was praying for an opportunity. And wow. so through the media, she was able to connect with us mm -hmm. and that get Tanner incredible. that van. And we were able to buy that van yeah. from her and then, you know, have it fixed up and stuff. Yeah. But, yeah, wow. I mean, the, um, all the, you know, the major TV stations and all, mm -hmm. they love to cover our events. They've been mm -hmm. great with, with our medical fundraisers. Yes. And they've said, you know, we like to cover nice stories. You know, no. we, we don't, we don't want to cover all these nasty uh -huh. stories. We, we have to, but, you know, mm -hmm. we really like to, you know, have some nice stories to cover. And they, they appreciate what we do. And so they have been really very, very much of a partner. That is absolutely phenomenal. How can people support All Things mm. Possible Ministries? Allthingspossible.org. Okay. <laughs> so okay. That's our website. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, whenever we're doing a medical fundraiser or, or an event like this, um, it's always on our website and Facebook. Uh, we have a Facebook page, of course, and mm -hmm. Twitter and all that. So we're we're out there you know as much Excellent. as we as we can be so just keep up with us and if folks go on our website have them, you know they need to sign up for our mailing list mm -hmm. we've got about 2500 people on it right now wow um, and That's it's growing awesome. all the time so people want to know what we're doing and want to keep up with us and like michael had mentioned earlier with our medical fundraisers mm -hmm. uh, the, what's unique about it is that 100% of the money that comes in that's during a medical campaign for you know the fundraiser mm -hmm. goes toward the bills of that that family wow. um, we That's don't incredible. keep a dime and you know we absorb all the costs of doing it but mm -hmm. we, we you know we don't get anything from it because that's not what it's about right so when people make a donation to one of our medical fundraisers they can meet the family mm. they can you know like we were right. had them here tonight that's right they can meet the family they can get to know them they can you know give them you know a donation personally the family gets an opportunity to say thank you face to face yes um, and it's that personal connection that's so important. And you know where your money's going. That's right. You know, it's not like that's writing right. a check that goes to who knows where, you know. That is true. And how much of it goes to, you know, mm -hmm. what you want. So that's why we do things like Exalt. And in the spring, we'll do a golf tournament. Okay. And that's to raise money to keep the ministry alive. Wow. To pay all those expenses. Absolutely. Because we don't want to take anything out of that medical pot. Uh, Lisa doesn't take a salary, so there's not much over here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, but the thing that's really cool with this ministry too, that part of the story we don't always tell, mm -hmm. is stories like Riley, mm -hmm. with her, his grandparents, yes. who are sleep deprived, right? Mm -hmm. They're living in 12-hour yeah. shifts, hardly see each other because they're taking mm -hmm. care of him. That's right. Is it gives it families hope. So we've had more mm -hmm. families wind up going back to church. Mm -hmm. um, Barbara, Tanner's mom, surrendered her life to Christ at this event last year. Yes. Um, so, did. you know, it's as much about extending the a mm -hmm. message of hope to the families mm -hmm. and just loving on them and showing them Jesus yeah. as well. Yeah. And it's and it's not for us it's not just about, you know, the money to purchase the equipment or whatever, you know, that they mm -hmm. need, the medical um, the medical need. But we come alongside them as as their helpers. You know, we right. we right. want them to feel loved mm -hmm. and special. Yes. Um, because their their day to day life is so taxing mm. um, that we really want you know, want to pamper them if we can. Yes. So, like for example, we had we did um, hair and makeup for the contestants tonight. We mm -hmm. had folks that volunteered their time, wow. and Riley's grandma. We had her do hair and makeup. Okay. We have Barbara Adkins, you know, mm -hmm. little Tanner's mom. We said, oh, come on, you need to do your hair, have your hair mm -hmm. and makeup done, you know, by somebody else. And they they felt like princesses, you know, because it's wow. it's just nice to be able to treat people. Yes. You know, in different in ways that you know they they're just not you know accustomed to being able to do. That's true. I'm sure talking to the contestants, you found that they shared that they made lifelong friends 
Mm. Absolutely. And they were certainly appreciative of the opportunity to be able to serve in this capacity Mm -hmm. and be able to share their gifts uh, to win souls for Christ and to help Mm -hmm. raise funds uh, for for the ministry. God's gifted them with the ministry of their own. That's right. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. We had a kid five years ago who was 17 at the time, Mm -hmm. sold out for Christ. His tattoos all over him, scripture. Wow. and, And could hardly look you in the eye. He was so timid. Really? He's now leading praise and worship. That is absolutely yeah. awesome. Yeah, so we just encourage wow. somebody to take their gift to the next mm-hmm. level then. And we, that we've done our job. Yeah. And we love music. So Yeah. That's you know, right. And, and, and a whole bunch of other people do as well. Yep. Exactly. And yeah. there's just so much talent in this community yes. that folks need to know about it. Mm-hmm. Um, and we were talking to uh, Bishop Whedon tonight mm-hmm. from TBN. And he's he's so excited about what we do. He's just <laughs> he's such a sweet he's man. He's connected. I just, just yes. Yeah, yeah, he's he's he got is. all kinds of plans for, for mm-hmm. things for us. Um, That's right. Which is great. He's we had him here on the red carpet. Way. Did you? And he was just flying. Yeah. Okay. yeah. I was like, calm, calm down, calm, calm down, Bishop. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Uh huh. Yeah. He's a minister, you know. <laughs> Absolutely. But we've made some amazing friends through this. Wow. We even have people calling us saying, you know, what can we do to help? Mm-hmm. Um, how can we volunteer? Uh, can we be a judge? You know, wow. I mean, that kind of stuff. Yeah, we so. have about 45, 50 volunteers for this event. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It takes a that lot of people to incredible. make this happen. Yeah. That is true. It does. And they keep help. coming back. You're glad yeah. for punishment. <laughs> yeah. Help, hope, love. That's yep. right. That's what makes up all things possible ministries. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Wonderful. You guys do an absolutely phenomenal job. We're certainly encouraged by your ministry, by your level of support for those that are in need. And through you, other people are able to now witness Christ at its best Mm -hmm. so that they can go back outside of these four walls and do for him what it is that you guys do on a daily basis. Yeah, very we're proud all, of We're you. all working oh, for the same you. guy. That's right. Same boss. <laughs> well, that's it. Same boss. Yeah, that's yeah right. we tend to overcomplicate it, but we're here to help each other out. Yeah. That's yeah. right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Family. Thank you for help. Oh, you're mm-hmm. extremely welcome. Yeah. Certainly Thank you. Our, our pleasure mm-hmm. and, and certainly our, our reasonable service. Yeah. <laughs> Family, you're tuned in to the Profit and Growth Hour here on WDRB Media and WGIV, the soul of Charlotte. I am Dr. Business, and we'll be right back.